One of the greatest questions that I think we have on Pesach is this idea of matzah, right? Ask anybody, why do we eat matzah for? And their answer is, well, a long time ago, my mom, for the first time in the history of Jewish mothers, thought about something besides food, like getting out of Egypt and forgot to bake the bread. So the bread didn't rise, we had to leave, we had bad bread, and so forever and ever and ever and ever and ever, we've gotta have bad bread on Pesach. Thanks, Mom. Really? God spends a year basically pulling every trick in the book, rocking the Egyptians. God couldn't have given the women an hour. No one could have sent around a text. We're leaving at noon. And okay, fine. Back then, we had a technical issue. We had to run out of Egypt. No one's running out of Egypt today. We know Pesach is coming. We've been cleaning forever. Why do I gotta suffer with matzah when I can make bread? In truth, the matzah doesn't represent the technical issue of running out. We did leave in a hurry, but we didn't have to. Hashem could have done anything. Matzah represents something even more than that. Matzah represents how you become free. You see, in life, many times we're stuck, we're blocked. We've got issues, it's life. We are stuck in our own Mitzrayim. We are constrained with whatever issues we have, relationships, money, sickness, health, happiness, whatever they are. We many times either put ourselves or are put into our own personal Mitzrayim. And then an opening comes. Someone gives us an idea. There's an opportunity to jump on something. There's a chance I could make amends with somebody. I can say the things I need to hear. I can start something new. I could change my life. There's a time in our lives where we have a small window of opportunity. We can take ourselves out of our issues. What happens is, is as soon as that happens, we look and see that it's gonna be difficult, and we don't say no, we say tomorrow. We don't say, I don't wanna have that conversation. We say, you know, I'll call her tomorrow. We don't say, I don't wanna learn more, or be better, or try a new business out, or change my eating habits. We don't say that, because we know it's true. We say, I'm gonna do it later. I'm gonna do it tomorrow. Hashem understood the following. If you wanna be free, when the window opens up, you take it now. Matzah isn't because of what happened then. Matzah is a reminder for how to be free today. Because Mitzrayim is more than just a place on the world, it's a place in our lives. And Pesach isn't valuable because it happened a long time ago. It's valuable because it happens today to all of us in our own ways. And if you wanna be free for the issues that have been plaguing you all year, Many times the answer is, act now. Move. Don't wait for it to rise. Don't wait for later. Don't wait for tomorrow. There may not be a tomorrow. There's an opportunity, take it now.